Chicago, in the midst of the Great Depression. City of the bent shoulders, the shattered windshield, the bad back. A city Nelson Algren described as not so much a city as a drafty hustler's junction in which to hustle a while and move on out of the draft. In November 1932, a filmmaker named Conrad Freiburg picks up his camera and travels the length of a single Chicago street, south to north. Not State Street, not Michigan Avenue, but the backbone of Chicago, Halstead Street. It's a stretch of pavement, both enriched and torn apart by class and ethnic divisions. When you go over a bridge or under a viaduct on this street, you left one country for another. It's the American melting pot at full boil. Now, at the end of the century, at the beginning of a new millennium, we wondered what we'd find traveling the length of Halsted Street, as Freiburg's camera did in 1932. If this is the melting pot, can it melt? Should it melt? And who are these people today that make up this stew? What thoughts and dreams, conflicts and tensions, simmer up through the cracks in the pavement?